have to wake up, but open your eyes. What's the matter? Somebody hit you? Here, let me help. At Andrew, you getting these alerts? Kind of busy here. It sounds like real trouble. At the engine, they said Hope made a lateral ascension. What do we hope? They're not happy about it? No. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Come on. They've paged for you three times already. There's something urgent at the engine. Wayland what are you doing in here anyway? I thought you were just a software guy. Report to Morphogenic Engine Monitoring immediately. Wayland Park to ME Monitoring. We're not being given enough information to trust Renegade's predictions. He's been right so far. I just want to know we're inventing something other than shiny new cancers. that the stress response is going to affect the capillaries. Of course. The therapy's relying on it. Hope maxed out at 190? Parts per million, yeah, but those are precursors to precursors. I'm worried about losing anti-apoptotics. 190 isn't bad. The doctor was predicting assembly by 150. 
We're not being given enough information to trust Wernicke's predictions. He's been right so far. I just want to know we're inventing something other than shiny new cancers. I'm worried that the stress response is going to affect the capillaries. Of course. The therapy's relying on it. Hope that's out at 190. You're Whalen Park, yeah. aren't you? Why weren't you answering the page? I'm worried about you. I'll tell them you're incoming. Girlfriend or somebody? I'm married. How long since you've seen her? Honestly, I'm not even sure. How about you? Going back to Leadville to pick up Jane, then we're headed out to the lake. That sounds all right. I didn't think I'd miss her this much. If the patients start to realize they haven't seen a woman or a child in shit years now, right? How long's it been since you've seen Jane? Three weeks now? That's nothing. You're serious? Sure. You got a girlfriend or somebody? Christ, Whalen, hurry up! They're waiting on you! Ah! They're cutting it close. Next patient's incoming and arterial spin's still dark. We need you at the front terminal. Been. Functional imaging in faces and talking to the ASL. We got a patient 30 seconds out and we're blind inside his head. I could call into the chamber, ask them to delay. No, I don't need another performance evaluation. Mr. Park here is going to have us up and running before we even know it. Right, Mr. Park? Are we happy, Mr. Park? Uh, Steve? FMRI is still dark. You're doubting our friend, Mr. Wayland Park? Which I consider more than unkind to his programming skill and considerable dedication to the Murkoff Corporation. <laughs> Fuck me, they're bringing him in. Yourself. This is a high security. It's all right, Agent. Mr. Park was just surprised. I'm sure he's still calm and eager to finish his work. Take your seat. Quickly, Mr. Park. Head will need to roll if the fusion monitoring is not active when we put him in the engine. 
five seconds. Four. Three. Arterial spin labeling is back online. Good thing. Positioning imaging planes. You're finished, Mr. Whalen Park. You can leave. Don't expect anything but honesty in my review of your performance. All right. Sure, hold on. They only give me categorical 25 minutes. You're done here, Mr. Park. Thank you, and goodbye. Eyes on the floor, one foot in front of the other until you're back in your hole. You need to exit the room, sir. Somebody's been telling stories outside of class. On the floor! Down! Hands where I can see him! Mr. Whalen Park. Consulting contract 8208. Software engineer with a level 3 security clearance. Graduated cum laude from Berkeley, but still somehow not smart enough to realize that the last thing a fly ought to do in a spider's web is wiggle. Somehow dumb enough to think that a borrowed laptop, onion router, and firewall patch would be enough to fool the world's leading supplier of biometric security. Stupid, Mr. Park. More than stupid, in fact. That was crazy. I'm afraid we're going to have to have you committed. Mr. Park, will you willingly submit to forced confinement? Did you hear that, Agent? He said yes, Mr. Blair. Great. Oh, and, uh... Did I just hear Mr. Whalen Park volunteer for the Morphogenic Engine program? Well, that's what I heard, Mr. Blair. That was brave indeed, Whalen. The Murkoff Corporation and the Onward March of Science both appreciate your bravery and sacrifice. Maybe you could administer Mr. Park here a light anesthetic. Gladly. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 